The fourth annual Art Affair at Belmont Village Senior Living is a special event in the community. It showcases incredible local artists and giving back to support senior programs. It's a wonderful opportunity to enjoy art, all while making a difference. Here to tell us more about the big events, Erica Karens. She's the Director of Community Relations at Belmont Village. It's great to have you back here. Well, thank you so much for having me. I, I mean, it's it. knocking on the door. It's tomorrow. It's tomorrow so we want yes. to get people there. You brought some great examples yes. of the art mm -hmm. that you purchased uh, just throughout the years. But uh, first of all, kind of, and it's the fourth year that you all have had this. Yes. You know, where do you get the art and who does it benefit? Well, so I try and find new artists for each, um, you know, each event. So we typically try and have somebody that works in glass, metal, um, you know, different forms of, of painting, whether it's acrylics or watercolors, jewelry, just a whole variety. Yeah. Um, you know, uh, actually this year I have somebody who works in concrete, so. Oh. There we go. Yeah. All It'll different mediums uh, will be different. represented. Yes. Uh, and the money, of course, goes to a wonderful cause, St. Yes. Matthew's. Um, Ministry. It goes to St. Matthew's Area Ministries. Mm -hmm. Um, we've been obviously doing this for four years. Um, the relationship between Belmont Village and, and St. Matthew's Area Ministries has been longstanding. Mm -hmm. um, and when I joined Belmont, um, we kind of, you know, tried to think of something that we wanted to do that would benefit, and we came up with Art Affair. So. It's fun. We we try we try and raise you know uh, well this year we're trying to raise at least five thousand nice. dollars. So and it does go to all of their programs. I mean you know donations are great, but they still have to go out at times and purchase items. Right, right. To keep their uh, pantries full. And I can only imagine the need has to be greater than ever. Yes, yeah. um, a lot of people I think would. That in, you know, St. Matthews really are there people in need in St. Matthews. Mm -hmm. It's a rather affluent right. area, but there really are. There's right. a lot of um, people that have come in from other countries and you know are struggling with the language and getting jobs and being able to support themselves. So, mm -hmm. you know, they rely on on the food resources that St. Mams offers as well as you know utility assistance, rent assistance, things when like that. When we think of just the cost of groceries, utilities. Yeah. So many things are sky high are people that have lost their jobs and they don't want to make a fuss, right? Mm -hmm. and, but they've got to choose between a couple different things. This becomes so vital to kind of help the family move forward. Don't you see that too? Just people that don't want to let, the, I, I just need to go pick up some food. <laughs> you know, I don't right. want to like make a big, I don't want to make a big um, a deal about this. Well, you talk us through like some of the artwork that you've purchased. Yes, Gorgeous. well, um, so over the years, I always try and purchase um, art from the artists that, you know, uh, you know, they're donating their time and. These are artists from all over the community that you yes, find? Yes, in, in Louisville, mm -hmm. in Louisville. Um, so this was a piece that I actually bought last year. Um, it's, it's intended to the go print. down to Florida, but it hasn't made its way there ah. yet. So, <laughs> um, but I just, ah. I fell in love with, you know, just with the, the design, the, the colors. I thought it was very vibrant. Um, glass blowing, we have the little pumpkin here. That is adorable. Um, woodworking, so that is a bowl that mm. she created uh, from, you know, just carved it out of one piece of wood. Yeah. And um, it's very unique in that, I don't know if you can see that. I it love has, that, my eyes on has, that, that's great. It has this red. Oh, it has red inside, let me see if I can hold it up. It's a see special, it. but yeah. Right inside there, yeah. we can see um, the different colors and the variations of it. Yeah, I mean, this it's she's gorgeous. really, yeah, she's really good and she's. Well, here I can see it there. There we can even see it, right yeah. there. Well, I think th this is a wonderful chance that, I mean, I'm already looking for like holiday Christmas bazaars and exactly. stuff. Exactly. And so if you can't get enough of the holidays <laughs> already and you want to crank it up and get started and help a great cause, because I think too, more and more people, if you get something that is a unique piece of work to give somebody, I think the story behind it, mm -hmm. right, and what this helped yes. is an equally important thing. Do you need to purchase tickets or anything that we need to know about that? So, yes, you can purchase tickets through the St. Mam's website, www dot st ma'am dot com slash very long events yeah right there there you go there we and, go and uh or you can buy them at the door okay. tomorrow uh begins at five and it runs till eight 
and it's just a really fun evening. Great evening for that. Great to see you again. Thank you. It's like our yearly get together I talking know. about this. I love we'll this. We'll see you next we'll year. We'll see you next year. <laughs> All right. Uh, an art affair is happening tomorrow at Belmont Village in St. Matthews. Uh, Belmont Village Senior Living in St. Matthews. The event begins at five. It goes until eight. Tickets are $25 per person. They can be purchased in advance. Also, just take care of it at the door. Mm -hmm. Again, just remember you're helping um, a wonderful cause giving back to St. Matthews Ministries.